Uh, if I was to describe the Cordon Bleu in three words, it would be French. Intense, rewarding. When I think of Cordon Bleu, when I think of this time I spent in the college, is uh, exciting, very exciting. Uniqueness, professional. It's difficult, it's disciplined, but it's a hell of a lot of fun. So while I was at university, I fell in love with cooking. I wanted to grow my knowledge. I wanted to learn more about food, preparation, and formal skills. And having researched lots of different courses, I felt that Cordon Bleu had the best, you know, very, very classical French techniques. I wanted to learn the skills, and I felt that it would be the best place for me to do that. I have such a wonderful memories at Cordon Bleu. I've been always wanted to learn cooking, especially professional training, and because Cordon Bleu is the best uh, in the world, and I was aware of uh, such a great reputation. You come into a really warm kitchen classroom, sit there with people who are as enthusiastic as you about food, the passion is completely shared, and it's just that great feeling, it's a lovely, cosy feeling. I mean, moving to, to London the first time and uh, entering the school, I remember the first time it was in a very cold morning in January. It, it, it was very exciting, it was very exciting, you know, it was a lot of, everything was exciting, everything was new and the smell and the flavour and the, the environment, everything was absolutely fantastic. London is a great city, it's such a diverse mixture of culture, food of course, art, music, and a fashion architect, uh, everything, I love it. I always say this, one of the best things I've done for myself, and I mean it, is to, to enter the Cotton Blue. It was, as I just say, it was, it was just a new door, you know? For sure, it gave me a lot of you know, good understanding about food prep and technique and skills, but it also helped me with planning. I'm a lot cleaner, and definitely a more patient cook, thanks to that. <laughs> Le Cordon Bleu has shaped my career in the sense that it's given me the foundations and the techniques that anyone who wants to be a food writer or a, a TV chef or even just a restaurateur needs. I couldn't have that knowledge to write those recipes and deliver that information to them without the information that I learned here at Cordon Bleu. You have to love what you do and I mean it. You have to love what you do and uh, sometimes you have to be prepared to sacrifice is probably the word. You know, if you're going to do this as a job, you want to do it in an area that you really love, that's the most important thing. Enjoy it. Like Food is a pleasure and a delight and cooking is so fun. No matter what you do in life, you've got to put your heart into it and you've got to have the passion that you need to be successful. And it's really hard work. I, you know, it's exhausting. But if you are truly keen to work in the industry, that will be child's play.